Good evening. Today is the uh, second day of September 2015, and today I have been uh, performing necessary house chores. Specifically, you know, that mostly with, you know, that clearing out the sink. Well, the kitchen sink, that is. Then, uh, also, was that I had to take and, uh, was it wash a couple loads of, wash another load of, uh, dirty laundry, specifically my bed sheets, which did have a little bit of, uh, pee-pee in them know that leaked you know was it uh, I probably last night probably was it rolled off the pad a little bit you know with it and uh, you know was it piddled on the uh, on the on my sh in my bed you know was it uh, while I slept even though you know was it I was diapered. Then uh, today I also had to take and uh, was it uh, go up to London Dairy, you know, to the Ford of London Dairy to take and uh, get the uh, oil and oil filter changed in my uh, handicapped adapted car. You know, because I was just slightly overdue for an oil change, you know, with it. Be sure I got to get that done. You know, is it, uh, before was it, uh, fall officially arrives. Fall and the uh, start of winter. Then, uh, well, anyway, not much else has happened today. And of course, was it I did uh, also, uh, you know, was it when I, while I was out, was it running errands, you know, I like to get my oil and filter change, oil filter change in my car. I took and uh, purchased another 28 count package of adult sized diaper pants for myself and of course right now I'm just simply uh, sitting here on my plastic pail potty chair of course I've also was it uh, taken off my leg braces but a little later on, you know, after it gets dark, I may decide to take and uh, perform some uh, backyard astronomy between uh, 10 p.m. and midnight with my uh, three-inch Newtonian reflector telescope. You know, instead of was watching the television. Of course, the only thing that's with halfway decent on TV tonight is on uh, WGBH DT Digital Television. Was it uh, Channel 2 out of, was it uh, Brighton, Massachusetts? Is gonna be with it the uh, doing another with it uh, with that live BBC's live was it? Uh, of course, it's probably been with it uh, pre-recorded and just was rebroadcast here. A program called Big Blue Live about uh, topics in uh, oceanography and uh, and live. And about life in the oceans. 
then afterwards at 9 o'clock tonight is going to be uh, my, uh, was it Nova, the uh, PBS's uh, Nova, and tonight the TV show is going to be all about the, the biggest dinosaur that's ever been found or discovered. Which, which should be good. The answer is yes, I do like dinosaurs. My favorite dinosaur is uh, Ankylosaurus. Ankylosaurus was a very large herbivore type dinosaur that had that w that had was a uh, armor on its back and a heavy was a uh, was a uh, was a uh, bashing club on the end of its tail Of course, too, today, you know, that I've been, uh, also, was it, uh, you know, checking up on my email messages, and, uh, preparations are still going on for the, uh, coming up on the 17th, I'm going to be, uh, shooting video of a uh, public forum hosted by the Massachusetts chapter of the ADAPT Civil Disability Civil Rights Organization and uh, the first uh, first program public forum was it is going to be on about autism and the autism spectrum totally from the autistic point of view and of course my role as a uh, now a pretty fairly new member of the uh, Massachusetts chapter of ADAPT is that I am going to be uh, with it, uh, doing the uh, video production you know with a uh, shoot video of it you know that so that way we have a uh, permanent record of the uh, of the event. Another thing that's going on is that uh, you know was it uh, was it uh, planning is starting is uh, going on for the uh, uh, my uh, local chapter of was it. Ace and the Autistic Self Advocacy Network to take and produce a five minute public service with a uh, independent film, independent video production, you know, with it outlining why physician assisted suicide should not be adopted in the states of both Massachusetts. And here, in my own state of New Hampshire, and oh yes, there will be another uh, was it uh, bill coming up in sometime soon, not sure when, that will be introduced to was it permit physician-assisted suicide in the, in New Hampshire, which ASEN. My, the organization I'm a member of, and other disability or rights organizations are vehemently opposed to because physician-assisted suicide is always pitched towards persons like myself with lifelong disabilities. Essentially was it uh, 
and the bill that was uh, up uh, last year in tw 2014, you know, that uh, had no protections against was it uh, involuntary youth in Asia. I think they're going to try to pull another wh whoever was it is trying to was it uh, push for this bill in New Hampshire and of course also in Massachusetts. You know, was it is uh, essentially was it repacking the same bill with just a few words changed, you know, which doesn't mean a damn hill of beans. To pardon my use of a uh, dead metaphor, or shall I say, a uh, cliché. Of course, the way I understand uh, metaphors is just simply as, simply as, was it, uh, clichés coming out of my rote memory for, was it, uh, language. And, of course, was it, uh, yes, today has been very, very hot today outside. And, of course, was it, uh, I do have to go outside again to, you know, I should go outside again tomorrow to take and, uh, do some more, was it, uh, cutting down of, was it, uh, nuisance wild shrubs, you know, that have overgrown in the garden. I've got most, I said I've got most of it done, but I got, uh, I got, I've got more to take and do. And, of course, coming up for the weekend, I've got, uh, two video shoots. One up in Lancaster, New Hampshire, at the, uh, Lancaster, uh, County. At the Lancaster, was it, uh, was it Agricultural Fair. And then I'll go up to the, then uh, I also have a video shoot at the, uh, Hopkinton, uh, State Fair in Hopkinton, here in New Hampshire. So there were two, we do uh, two was it video shoots this weekend, you know, and uh, try to get uh, two was it uh, one hour TV shows out of what I shoot for next week. Anyways, all I'm doing is just was it just trying to stay cool and comfortable and just sitting on my plastic pail adult potty chair and just letting the pee uh, pee come out intermittently every so often. You know, and just simply, uh, you know, they just go back to what it, uh, you know, uh, reading news articles online via the internet. <laughs>